Hello guys and welcome back to an episode of the Connor Games. We are back with more LEGO Dimensions. So far, it turned out to be quite a promising game actually. Oh, what's that? Ah, let me go. Let me go. I said let me go. Can only characters such as uh, the, the, wit the witch, um... Eh? Okay, okay. Whoa, what? Oh god. Okay, damn it, just let me go. I want to build a winged monkey. I've already built it. I've built everything so far, okay? I don't want to place a model on the fucking... Oh my god. Dominic, I'm not turning my shit off so you can fuck off, okay? I'm busy making videos, so... It's not right, guys. Okay. Oh, there you go. Let's see what's over here, shall we? Oh, I'll take the witch off. Try not to use non-necessary characters unless it's needed. Oh, that was amazing! <laughs> well, I admit it's quite an interesting approach on the Wizard of Oz. If it's all going to be the same like approach or anything, but. Let's bring all this down. Of 
quite an interesting version, considering most of these dimensions have never actually been LEGO before. This is a really good interpretation of The Wizard of Oz, and I love this movie, so, you know, I'm, I'm loving this bit so far. I had so much shit in this game, like, Jesus Christ. I just want to see what all the dimensions are. Okay, I'll get out of the vehicle, Gandalf, seriously. No one beats the mighty Gandalf for combat, you know what I mean? All I'm saying is you may try, but you will not succeed. Oh... I usually play Lego games, like, it's not something I'd ever consider myself doing on this channel, but... Oh my god, why do I keep having to switch the characters around? It's ridiculous. Yeah, I did. Calm down, man. That's right. It's the best. 